Betty White show is already being hailed by the critics as one of the season's newest, funniest, and best. Oh. And I'm wondering, does this cause any pressures on you? It's sort of like a ball player who's getting up to the, the, the plate and they're saying, hey, this person's going to hit a home run. Oh, yes, it does. I love the positives that we're going in with. I mean, that I'm not fighting, but it means we better fulfill or we're in terrible trouble. You know, maybe we could just show the first show over and over and over again and not have to do any more. Well, what kind of lady is Joyce Whitman? She's not as rotten as Sue Ann. She's a little bit better than that, but not an awful lot. <laughs> she uh, she doesn't start the trouble. She, if somebody zings her, she can handle herself and zing them back pretty well. But her, her big problem, she's not as promiscuous as Sue Ann either. Her big problem is uh, her director in this show, within a show, is her ex-husband, with whom she has kind of a running battle. They've, they're sort of hung up on each other, but they can't live together. Uh, in addition to your ex-husband, what's, what's that actor's name? John Hillerman. John and he's wonderful. He's funny, yeah. He yeah. is, I think, going to be really the, the new star of this film. The interplay between the two of you in the preview segment we saw <laughs> was just a delight. Well, what you see is what you get. Yeah, that's, that's, you that's fabulous. What other uh, regulars will be in the show? Georgia Engel. Right. She's not going to play Georgette, but she's going to be uh, Mitzi, my best friend, who, when John moved out, she moved into the house to share expenses, and uh, she's going to get a job in a pet shop, which will make me happy. Now, just out of curiosity, how would Joyce Whitman react to Sue Ann Nivens? How would those two get along? I think Joyce would size her up pretty well and cut her down to size. Okay. And it would, Sue Ann wouldn't feel a thing. <laughs> <laughs> now, what would Joyce Whitman think of Betty White? Oh, she'd probably not pay too much attention to her. She thinks she's over the hill. There's nothing, you know, she's no competition. <laughs> all right, Joyce is on the set and all of a sudden walking on as a spectator is Alan Ludden. What would her reaction be to Alan? Well, she might then not worry so much about getting back with John. I think she'd oh, maybe right. kind of find a new field to conquer. Speaking of Alan, will he be in any of the shows? No, no, only in the audience rooting me home. Oh, oh, because it would seem to me that he would be a natural, you know, for a guest shot or something or other. It would be fun to do sometime. I think after we get maybe all the characters established so that so that we all know who we are. You know, after, after playing Sue Ann for so long, uh, you knew her pretty well, but I'm not too familiar with Joyce yet, so I don't know what some of her hang-ups are. That would be, that would be kind of a very in-joke to have him in the cast, you, you know, just show up as, as an extra and just have you react to him as And whatever. just walk through. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, how much will we be seeing of Undercover Woman, per se? Mostly backstage. Um, very little of the actual police show action will be on, on, uh, on our program but it's a reason for us all to be there together. We will be around the rehearsal table. We will be rehearsing scenes at times. I have a 200-pound stunt double who dresses the same way I do all the time. <laughs> Charlie Cyphers wears everything I wear. Charlie? That's it. Well, Hugo is his character name. But it's wonderful. We have an upcoming script with a, a ball gown. We're both dressed as countesses. <laughs> with the hair on the chest and the tattoos and everything. And <laughs> as the, the witchy girl in the show says, she says, oh, really, Joyce? Where are your tattoos? <laughs> <laughs> can, can we see? Uh, is, is there, so there's not much of a chance that uh, Undercover Woman would be a spin-off? No, I don't think so. I think we have maybe one police show too many, ours. Well, I was going to say, I think that uh, seeing two shows with Betty White on would be just an absolutely super thing. Oh, I love your vote of confidence. I really do. Oh, you're too much. I do want to thank you for climbing my tower and talking with the owl. Anytime. And, <laughs> oh, right. And I just hope that the Betty White show runs season after season after season. I'm sure it will. Thank you. I really appreciate and that. And thank you so much for stopping by. I Hold love you. Hold a good you. thought for it. I love you. I love you. Right. <laughs>